In this video, I will install free PSD in VirtualBox in Windows 7. I assume you already installed VirtualBox. So open the VirtualBox. We create a new. So put a name free PST. PSD. So we should choose PSD. You can another selection. We just choose a PSD here. So my machine is the version is PS3 PSD. Is only 32 bit, so I can only install free PSD 32 bit. But you, if you have 64, you can install 64 free PSD. So let's click next. So this is the two on minimum recommend size one to eight. I will put the two five six a little bit more. So create a virtual drive here. Create this user default. Next, so dynamic locate use the default. So this is the default. So I try to put a 20 giga, 20 giga byte here and create it. So I create a, a free PSD here. Now I go to the settings. So settings. Now I shall go to storage and to install my ISO image. So for ISO image, I need to first go to freebsc.org, the ISO image here. This link, I go to 10.10. .10. So there's several things for us. 32 bits is the i3 6 DVD 1 ISO recommended. So if you have a 64 bit, use the AMD 64 or the DVD 1. The DVD 1 is better. DVD 1, the ISO. If you 64 bit, this is for see. This will click. So I already installed, download this in my download directory. So let's, let's go to storage here. Storage, I click empty. So click empty, I first choose choose a virtual CD and DVD directory. I get to find this one. Go to download. I have download this free PSD. I 36, I 3A6 here. So I open this one and here the show here. Now I call one to call leave CD and DVD. Because this is the virtual CD DVD I can put from here. You click OK. Because the put order is the floppy CD, CD DVD hard drive is a virtual one. So after this one, we can start to put from a virtual CD DVD. The virtual box is loading here. Load config. And I use the default. Let the default put it. Did not choose anything here. So default body after this body it will show this page. It did not show me any setup. I just need to install it again. Click this install. Click this install. It will first look at the key map. So a key map I use the default. So use the host name, I just free BST. Click OK. Uh, everything is Default, default, entire disk, finish, commit. So let's set load password. Let's select network. Yes, default, yes. 
So we only need to config IV, IPv4, not IPv6. So we do not recommend use the IPv6, so we choose the no. So you see here that this network configuration, if you automatically config resolvers configuration, they give the two IP and search tell us and give the two DNS. So that's good. I just put OK default return. It is amazing similar set to UTC. We don't want to choose the UTC because we want to cho uh, choose the local time. So I press no. So I want to put here American North and South and choose Canada. And I'd like to choose Pacific Time. Pacific Time, West British Columbia. This is what uh, I located. So press OK. Use PTT Daytime Saving. Yes. So this one I just use default as HD is OK. Uh, not user because okay, we'll get add another user here. Login name, my name, full name, my name. UID at default, group default. So just put a default here. Home directory default. Yes. No, no, default, and put a password for the name and name. Same name. And default. So my account is just default. Okay, okay. No, we don't, and that user, I just test one user. So now is it has several options, host name, root password, etc. We already set up, so we just execute this one. Put OK. OK, now yes. OK, now one thing we already installed from the uh, uh, DVD, virtual DVD. CD. So we don't want to next time reboot from DVD again. So we go to device, CD, DVD, we uncheck this one. We don't want to install again, uncheck this one. Let's set false unmanned. Yes, we don't want to, next time we want to alternate reboot, we don't want to this one, false unmanned. So now I go to machine to reset it, now to reboot it, to reboot it, machine reset it, virtual box, if you, sometimes if you want to out of, the, out of this virtual box, and the mouse, you just control, um, use the right control key, you can exit this mouse, if the mouse stuck here, use the right control key in the keyboard. Use the auto boot, we just let auto boot here. You automate boot. I, I, when he in auto boot, I just choose the auto boot. Then you can show all the messages with DSC. So I chose the default, I did not uh, select multi users, I just uh, let the automatic run here. And I just log in my name, root. And I have password. OK, now I want to do the ones. Now I'm trying to make name I just ping google.com. You see here, now it's ping is working. And list minus LTR. List here that is CD. 